Hey, how you doing? This is Ted Lasso. I'm the new head coach of the Tottenham Hotspurs, and uh, I'd like to talk to the Queen, please. My name's Ted Lasso. I'm the new head coach for Tottenham Spurs. Been brought over here to, to, you know, implement my coaching style. Football's football, no matter where you play it. You got grass, you got cleats, and you got helmets with masks on them. Football in the States is my specialty, but they have a different kind of football over here. Kick it! Circle them up, have them put on their pads, and let's start playing for real. They're wearing their pads, coach. There's a lot of, uh, a lot of small similarities. A team I coach, they're gonna play hard for all four quarters, okay? Uh, two halves. What's that? Two halves. Okay, halves. They're gonna play hard for two halves. And we're gonna play till there's a winner and there's or a loser. A tie. What's that? A tie. Okay, till there's a winner, a loser, or a tie. You can tie. If you tried to end a, a game in a tie in the United States, heck, that might be listed in Revelations as the cause for the apocalypse. Yeah, do we have any goals this season? Absolutely, we're gonna win a lot of games, we're gonna get in the playoffs. No playoffs. There's no playoffs. Again, my job just got a lot easier. Ties and no playoffs. Why do you even do this? One of the issues I've had is what tackling was. There you go, tackling! What the hell, is that? that's not a tackle. It's just sliding around. Soccer tackle, sir. Oh, all right there, Gary, that's how you tackle. To prepare for this job, you know, read a lot of books, watch a lot of game films, but to be honest with you, the best way to learn how to play this game is to play this game. The square goal? Circle. Circle's goal. See, I got you a little dosy do You don't know what to do. There you go. Good stop. Okay. Game That's over. Yeah, it's over for now. 15 yeah. nothing, huh? We're going to go in a rematch. Yeah, they do things a little bit differently. Part of me finds some of the things they do a little silly. Pass it in. Well, you keep passing it backwards. What's going on here? It's nice to be able to go backwards and forwards and not have some ref make a big deal about it. Will you explain to me how that was offside? No, I'm asking you. Seriously, explain it offside to me. It made no sense. Well, the first thing I had to do when getting this job was learn about the competition. We came up with the flashcard system in order for me to make American comparisons to English teams. All I had to do was link what I don't know to what I do know. Manchester United, super rich. Everybody either loves them or hates them. Dallas Cowboys. Liverpool, used to be great. Haven't won a title in a really long time. Also Dallas Cowboys. Cardiff City, dragons on the crest. What's that hot girl's name from Game of Thrones? Khaleesi. Khaleesi. Manchester City. Jennifer Lawrence. West Ham United. Pickup trucks. Because of that training that I did, I guarantee that we're gonna beat the Cowboys and the Cowboys and Jennifer Lawrence. Has there been a learning curve? I would say a little bit. I'm starting to understand why these scores are so low. Look how tiny these goals are. Those are practice goals, coach. <laughs> he knocked in that ball with his head. Is that legal? Totally legal. Hey, that's, wow, three points. No points. No points. Why not? It's got to go in. Come on, Rob. You got to get it in there to get three points. One point. They got like an application for a phone. I can learn the rules. What are these trust exercises? Who's uh, orange shoes there? Gareth Bale. That's Gareth Bale. Where he's from? He's from England? Wales. Wales? Wait, that's another country? Yes and no. How many countries are in this country? Four. But, but I'm learning, and, and I want to learn. These young men, they just would not understand exactly what I was trying to get them to do. Guys, all I'm looking for is 60% effort, 4,000% of the time. That's it, skip. Skip like little girls. Go, not a, not a care of the world. I'm lucky to be doing this for a living. Everybody just do the robot. You got to ride a few players a little bit harder than some of the other players. Blondie, you are killing me. John, what do you got on there pants-wise? What is those? Three quarters. And I get those in the women's section, John. Pick up the ball. Pick up the ball with your hands. That is a violation. In an act of solidarity, I spent an entire day not using my hands out of respect towards the game. And I think that went pretty well. I think it, it garnered a lot of respect from the players. They appreciated not only the fact that I could do most activities without the use of my hands, but that I just tried. After a few days of practice, players gave me a nickname. It started small, but now they'll chant it at me every now and then. That's pretty nice. Uh, what's the nickname? Wanker. Do you know what it means? I think it just means great. Like, just a, like a nice guy, like, you know, kind heart, you know. Someone that listens, someone that'll push you. A wanker is, a, is, is someone that doesn't mind being alone, you know, likes to sit with his thoughts. Well, with any new job, you gotta anticipate a learning curve. But I tell you what, I'm in Tottenham and I'm here to stay. You can guarantee that one second here. Oh, nope, I got fired. Premier League is on NBC and the NBC Sports Network, live on TV, online, or on the go. Is there a third kind of football maybe I could look into?